Well, fellas, and fellettes, I don't know if you guys can hear that very well or not, but it's raining. So, uh, you know, which is good, that helps. We're dry here, so, you know, what I'm going to do today. Yep, I brought them bitches on finally. Oh, excuse my French. Anyways, uh, just got the new bolts this morning, picked them up, blows. You know, I don't know what you guys use to bolt yours on, but that's what I'm doing. And it uh, works pretty good. Bolts I've used on the, uh, the mo cart. It's over here. She's got a stretch chain arc. Me and my buddy James rode her pretty hard the other day to track. You can see she's all kind of dusty and dirty. But, uh, anyways. I'm gonna bolt that on. And then, uh, also, see how creative. If I can't come up with something to make me something that simulates a grill and radiator. So, stick around. Let's see what we'll get done. Wrong direction. Righty tight left for Lucy. Three bolts to the hub. We'll have to cut out the fenders. Here. This we have to run to the outside over there. I made this cut out right here for that, so I can run the master cylinder over there. 
So I'm gonna put a handbrake on that, on that side. I got it tacked up over the way, out of the way right now. Don't want it dragging forward, maybe wearing the whole end eventually, so. Okay, <coughs> rear tires check. Now let's see if we can't mock up something on the front of this thing, make it look a little bit better. Okay, so I got this piece of a old barbecue grill that I've cut. It's about the right dimensions I want. I got one. And there's just no way I'm gonna ever get this stuff off of here. It's probably not gonna happen. Right there. Okay, then we get your paper peepers hooked up in here. Show you what's going on with my idea on this thing for front of this. You know, obviously, I'm just doing this for aesthetic reasons. Uh, not that it looks sharp or anything like that, but I am going to put a small frame around this. Just like that. Polish it up a little bit better the metal, the frame that is. And we're going to weld it right there. To resemble or simulate, anyways, a radiator and grill. That's the plan. Let's see if we can get her done. Hey, getting a little closer to my vision here, except I'm gonna trim this off on both sides, even it up, you know. Hey, you guys get the idea of what I'm talking about. And uh, this is gonna to have to be thinned down a little bit, but you know, just to give the radiator grill effect in a rough hot or rat rod kind of silver way. So we're on the right path. Stay tuned. Okay. Now you see a little bit of what I'm getting at here. And I'm thinking the cherry on top. Well, I'm gonna finish this up today and uh, we'll wrap this video up right now and uh, let you guys go about your busy days and we will see you guys next time. Thanks for watching. Please hit that like button and subscribe. We're growing like crazy fellers. And let's just keep it right on going. Keep that momentum going guys. So uh, appreciate every day going one of you subscribers. If you haven't subscribed, I still appreciate you. Just subscribe for me, will you? All right, we will see you guys next time. Peace.